Nine-year-old Dylan Laflamme is back with his friends at Hillside Elementary School after spending several days in the hospital. I was worried I wasn't going to see my son again. On May 18th, Dylan's dad came to pick him up from school. He says he watched him run to the playground and then suddenly collapse. At first, I wasn't sure if it was playing around a little bit, but it ended up being something more serious. Dylan had gone into cardiac arrest. A mom nearby called 911 and started CPR. I gave him two breaths and did the compressions. School nurse Katrina Annis then stepped in. And when I came upon Dylan, he was unresponsive. The school's AED was then used on Dylan. The medical device sends an electronic shock to the heart to bring back a normal heartbeat. And in Dylan's case, it worked. It was just a miracle that he came to. The school is amazing. And I thank God he was here. Dylan was taken by paramedics to a local hospital and then flown to Dartmouth Hitchcock, where he remained responsive. Early CPR, early defibrillation. We've emphasized that throughout the years. It works. Dylan now has a pacemaker and a defibrillator in his chest. Can you feel anything different? Yeah, there's a bump here. Dylan's parents say doctors don't know what caused him to go into cardiac arrest, but tests are being done. Principal Julie King says she's thankful for the outcome. The right people were there at the right time, and it all lined up perfectly. Staff here recommend that employees from all schools learn CPR and have an AED on hand just in case something like this should happen. Dylan heads back to school for a full day on Thursday. Reporting in Berlin, Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9.